Good morning, everybody. <clears throat> what a beautiful morning it is. It's a light breeze. It's about 15, 16 degrees. The water is lovely on the Grand River, and I've been having a great time walking. <clears throat> I'm so thankful for the team that I have working with me on the Senior Ministries leadership team. And last week when we had the uh, presentation by the uh, gardener, Christine uh, Gilhuli, Gilhuli, Christine Simpson, who is on our board, did an amazing job of taking us through 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verse 17. For if anyone is in Christ, they are a new creation. The old has passed and the new has come. That's what I feel like every spring. The aspect of things in the fall have died away and they've been covered with a blanket of snow and then spring comes and the old has passed away but the new springs out of that which was old. And you see it all over the place. You see some of the annual flowers that uh, are self-seeding like we heard about. And those flowers are have seeded themselves again into the ground and even though the old foliage has died and passed away and won't come back but the seed the new seeds that were seeded are springing up and causing life to happen once again and color and beauty once again and isn't that the wonderful thing about the lord that we serve that when there are things in our life that need to die he helps us to cut those things off of our life and just like those flowers when we are able to cut off those things which have hindered us and those things, those sins in our past that that continue to try to trip us up and we cut them off and let them die away. The Holy Spirit comes and fills us again with that which is new and fresh and vital that gives beauty to our lives and sustenance and strength. And also it gives beauty and sustenance and strength and provision to those that we live among and those whom we love and those whom we serve. So I pray that today and this week, as you go through this uh, first week of June, I pray Lord, that the Lord Jesus would give you much opportunity to marvel at his renewing strength in your life, his invigorating life, his beauty given through the ashes of that which has passed away. God bless you, church. Pray for you this morning.